What's up, best friends? Good morning. I'm back, y'all. I'm back from the cruise, as y'all can see. I'm in my room. Um, it is Tuesday, September 27th, y'all. I actually was supposed to be at work today, y'all, but I, y'all, as y'all can hear my voice, I don't have a voice. Y'all, I'm really just trying to get out of that field. Y'all, if you know, well, a lot of people know me. Uh, that's following me on here. Uh, I've been doing customer service, y'all, for the last 10 years. And y'all, I'm ready for a career change. I had a couple interviews last week, hoping to hear back from them. I'm believing I'll be hearing back from them one day this week, y'all. I'm just trying to get out of this field and get into something different. I mean, I'm still doing hair. I absolutely love doing hair. I know for a fact that's going to be my, eventually my full-time thing. I'll be doing hair full time, but I do want to secure me a, just a different career field, learn something different so that, because hair does slow down and I want to always make sure I have some type of funds coming in, y'all. So, um, basically today, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to get out, give out some of my business cards. They finally came in. Um, the Rich Homie concert is later today, so I'm definitely going to that. Uh, that's going to be around 7, I think, or doors open at 7. And then I have a I believe I have a, I know for sure I have a head to do this afternoon. I got a client who, um, I supposed to do them Friday, uh, Thursday before I left, but yeah, it was, time was cutting too close, so I had to reschedule them. So I have a client that's coming today. I have a possible client that may be coming today. Uh, tomorrow, I think I have two clients, no, I have, two, yeah, I have two clients that I'll be traveling to tomorrow evening. Um, Thursday, Friday I have, dang. It is Tuesday, so it's only four days left in this week. Friday, I have one client as of now. I'm opening my books for earlier that day so I can get a few more people in uh, if they want to book. Saturday, I'm pretty open. Sunday, I'm pretty open. And then Monday, of course, is a busy week because people birthdays. Well, people birthdays every day, but I got a couple people booked for their birthdays and stuff. So my hair thing is, is getting to where I need it to be. I want to be able to be booked, have the option to be booked every single day. And if I want to take off, I can. But... I need to be booked every day, at least two to three heads a day. That way I know for sure, okay, I can do this full-time. But in the meantime, I'm just thinking to me a full-time job and doing hair in the evenings, y'all. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so I decided not to go already. I don't have a voice. I can barely talk. Um, hopefully it'll be better tomorrow. I'm going to make me some tea today. But it's probably not going to be any better because if I'm going to this concert tonight, I'm done for. Done for. Um, but y'all, yeah, we're going to get some things shaking this week. That vacation was amazing, y'all. I have content that I'm actually going to start editing today as well. Go ahead and put that together so I can post that. I still got videos from the Wine Festival, the Rich Homie, and Chris Brown concert. Like, I have so much stuff, y'all, that I really need to put together and go ahead and post. So, that's probably what I'm going to do is work on these videos and get some things together, y'all. Um, so, I will talk to y'all later. Um, I need to go to the grocery store, too. Let me go to the grocery store. Guess we need to go to the grocery store. Yes, yeah, so I'll talk to y'all later. I'm going to go We're on our way to Tabernacle, as you can hear, Rich Homie. We're, we're headed to the Rich Homie concert, y'all. Hopefully, I can preserve my voice and I don't have to scream as much so I can go to work tomorrow, but we'll see. I mean, hoping to have a very good time. Um, yeah, so let's see.
middle school, elementary school, high school. Mays hiding this motherfucker, washing out this bitch, dog hiding this motherfucker. See the grove in this bitch. Better go hide this motherfucker. So south side niggas are here too. You ready? Yes. Hood rich, hood rich, hood rich. rich, 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 rich. rich. Hold on, say. Hey, light man, I need the lights on and I need them bright as fuck. I need the house lights on. I need it bright. Like it was an emergency in this motherfucker. Make it bright. Hey, don't get this shit misconstrued. This is a real Atlanta motherfucking party in the night. We're gonna do this shit like this. If you born and raised in Atlanta, Georgia, and you love that shit and you proud of that shit, on the count of three, I want you to scream your fucking hood out loud as you can. One. I heard the west side of the hill. I heard the east side of the hill. Zone 1 through 6 is in a motherfucking deal. We're going to do what we're supposed to do, so I need everybody to put a middle finger up. If your partner locked up a fuck up right now, put a middle finger up right now. If your partner locked up a fuck up right now. Queen's Bridge in this bitch, Nani. Georgia, what's my fucking I'm saying? East Coast, bitch, Nani. Word out. East Coast, East Coast. No, nigga, ATL in this Today, well, first off, it is Wednesday to uh, October 5th. I think it's the 5th. Y'all, I'm headed to the grocery store, y'all. Y'all probably wondering, like, why are you off? Or why are you not at work? And, yep, that's why I'm here. <laughs> yep, I'm here to talk to y'all about that. Tell me when she'll have to go off. Okay. So, y'all, um, for those that don't know, I guess I can talk and drive, but I don't have a mount, y'all. I done bought so many mounts for this damn car, and I just keep, they keep breaking or they don't work, so I don't know. Um, I really don't know what to do at this point. I'm tired of buying mounts, to be honest. So, yeah. But anyway, y'all, so I am headed to the grocery store, y'all. Okay. So yeah, y'all, I am headed to the grocery store. Um, and yeah, so back to what I was, what I originally came in for. I just wanted to talk to y'all because um, I've been recording clips, but I just haven't been posting like I should. Okay, I've been recording, but I have not been posting like I should. And I, I okay. So long story short, y'all. I quit my job. Um, I, I've been doing customer service and that was the um, field I was in. I've been doing customer service for years, y'all. 10 plus years. And it's draining, it's overwhelming. And a lot of people don't know, but I um, last year while I was working at Verizon, I went to see a therapist and all of that. 
And basically they did what they did and they determined that I have anxiety. Now, I only feel a certain type of way when I hear the phones ring or just when I have to clock into those types of jobs. Any other job that I've had that's outside of that field, I really don't battle with the, the anxiety. But when it comes to customer service, I deal with anxiety. Granted, customer service pays well. That's the only reason I just keep going back is because they pay pretty good. Like, I know I can make a good living. But the annoyance that comes from answering those calls, the metrics, you know what I'm saying? It's just, it's too much. It's too much, okay? I'm 32 years old, and at this point in my life, I just want to become or be the person that I want to be. My sister told me the other day, she said, stop trying to become that person and just be that person. Whoever it is that you want to be, be that person. Stop trying to become it. So, I'm not trying to become anything. I am the person that I desire to be. So, I quit my job, y'all. I've been doing hair full time for the last week, and it's been going pretty good. I've been pretty booked. For those of you that don't know, I am a loctician in the Atlanta area. Um, look me up on Instagram at Zanny Dulox. That's X A N N Y D O L O X. Um, I sell clothes as well. My boutique, I'm really going through a rebranding phase. I'm just trying to find items. I found a good vendor, but then I also found out this particular vendor sells their own items individually in their own boutique store. So I wanna, I'm looking for another vendor that has a little bit more of what I'm looking for that speaks Alexandria or that's me, you know? Um, and then of course YouTube, like I've been doing YouTube since 2018. I have not been consistent. That's my biggest downfall, but I enjoy doing YouTube. I really love editing. I really love posting y'all. And yeah, that's something I really want to get more into. So I decided to take a leap of faith. Now I know this process is not going to be easy at all. I already know it. I've jumped a few times and I got scared and ran back and got a job. But this go round is the final go round. I'm giving my all. I'm giving a hundred percent and I'm going to get everything that I desire plus more. I'm going to be exactly who I want to be. And I, I'm vlogging. This is day one of me vlogging because I want y'all to take this journey with me. I want y'all to see the process, you know, see the, the, the ups and the downs so that you can, that you know, that you can do it too. As long as you put your heart into it, whatever you desire to do, you can do it. Okay. Um, I've always told people, I even told my, my boyfriend, I told my boyfriend, um, the other day, I was like, I'm, I know I'm going to be bigger than just this. You know what I'm saying? I'm not a regular, regular person. I know that I'm going to be big. I know that I'm going to have a household name. I know that I'm supposed to be somebody bigger than what I am right now. I said, and I just got to put that work in. He said, yeah, I see that. <laughs> I see that. He said, just put in the word. You could definitely be that. So, y'all. <laughs> I'm I'm on I'm on grind mode right now, y'all. Like I'm really on some grind mode type stuff. Like it's fun. We'll get back on this conversation later, y'all. I'm actually headed to the grocery store so I can get some stuff. I went to Canada yesterday. Um, he ended up getting extensions and not just a retweet, so it took a little longer for me to finish. I I really didn't feel like cooking once I got done. My hands were hurting and I'm, my feet, my legs was hurting, so I didn't get to cook. But I'm a um. I'm really thinking about doing the shrimp, steak, and potato um, foil. And then I have some um, red lobster cheddar bay biscuits ooh, that I can make to go with them. So I, that's what I think I'm going to do. Because that wouldn't be bad. I want something different too. At first I was going to bake some chicken and like make some ca a cabbage and some sweet potatoes. But I'll change that for tomorrow because these pockets ain't going to pockets probably ain't gonna last too long and then i actually have instead of regular steak i have lamb steaks so i think that's gonna be very very good um i guess i'll show you how i make those i have a head at two today i'm waiting to see if anybody else will book y'all i'm not gonna allow you know this slow process to discourage me we got the holidays coming up it's fourth quarter i'm going in y'all like my goal is to vlog every single day i might not have that much to talk about y'all but y'all just stick with me until i figure out a true niche that i want to do i was thinking about doing locks but i'm kind of in the air because it's just like if, are people going to want to even listen to me talk about locks i mean i am a loctician you know and i do have locks but the people really want to hear that is itching y'all 
And I really want to get back on here because I invested in my business earlier this year. I actually took the Keisha Kayla, Keisha Kaylee and Jayla Corianne marketing class, y'all. And I've been in I've been using the tactics that they've taught us on Instagram, which I can be I'll be honest, it is like it has taken me up a lot using their tactics for Instagram. So I'm like, okay, let's go ahead and try the YouTube information that they provided. So I'm gonna try it. See where it gets me, y'all. Oh, I need to call my cellular provider as well. I need to call my cell phone provider because y'all, I went on a cruise last two weeks ago. What's up? What's up, y'all? It's your girl Sammy. Welcome to my channel, y'all. I know y'all probably be like, where has this girl been? I know it has been a minute. I have been recording, I just haven't been posting, which that defeats the purpose. But y'all, I am. I'm committing myself to sticking to this y'all and being consistent. The hardest part is that I'm um, the hardest part is that I'm vlogging from my phone. So I'm always out of out of storage and going through my phone to leave storage that takes time. But I do have a lot of content that's saved. So if I would just go ahead and post that content, then I wouldn't even have to worry about clearing out storage. I would have enough storage. So I'm gonna work on that, y'all. I'll probably post a few lost footage vlogs or something just to kind of get the build of momentum back up and get us you know back see i can see what i have been doing and get us on a smooth run so right now y'all i am headed cut this off because it's loud right now i'm headed to um empire um i well y'all don't know one thing i've been doing over the last few years few months not years the last few months almost a year um i'm no longer working for anyone at this time i'm working for myself um doing hair I'm um, trying to build my clientele. I decided I just wanted to jump out, y'all. The field that I've been working in is customer service, a call center. And that call center, the phone's ringing, triggers my anxiety. And I just felt like my mental health was more important than a dollar. What's meant for me, as long as I'm working on my purpose, it's going to flow. That's how I feel. So, I am headed to Empire Beauty School right now, y'all. Um... I have a walk around, walk through with them. It took me a minute to decide on which school I wanted to go to, but I had talked to one, I talked to my cousin, and she was just telling me, like, you know, out of all the schools, yeah, some of them might be cheaper, but Empire gonna give you what you need, which I agree. Empire is gonna give me what I need. And it'll also mix me in with other clientele, with celebrity clientele. So that's a plus. That's a plus, because that's what I'm trying to, you know, not like that's my ideal client or celebrities, but I do want me one good celebrity client that I could travel with. I don't have to because working from with multiple people is sometimes frustrating but if i could just give me a, a few good clients that i know are consistent i won't even accept any more clients y'all like for real i wouldn't but you know locks and hair those those they change and things change and you know so yeah anyway i'm headed to the school now it's 11 24 i gotta be there by 12. it's really not that far from me it's probably like a good 15 20 minutes I, but i need to run to this Run to the um. I need to run to the gas station. I really want me a Red Bull, y'all. Like I love Red Bulls. I love the way they taste. And my little boo, my little friend, was like, "The only thing I don't like is the crash." But my boo was like, "Get you a sugar-free one," which the sugar-free don't taste that much different than the regular ones. And he was like, "And hey, you won't crash." And I really don't crash off the sugar-free ones. Hold on, y'all. Let me throw this trash away. I'm to clean my car out today too, y'all. I'm so mad that summer came and left the way it did. Like, I'm a, I mean, fall isn't horrible. It's just not freezing cold. It's, it's very cold, but it's not freezing cold. So that's a plus. But goodness, we could have did at least a month and a half of summer, one more month of summer. I wouldn't mind it being um, warm during my birthday, which is never warm during my birthday, but you know. So yeah. I'm gonna stop by the gas station, get me a sugar free Red Bull, and then I'm gonna head to this school. So, my goal with YouTube, y'all, and what I really wanna do is just first, I'm just gonna start vlogging every day, and then I'll start doing random content and we can see what actually works, okay? Now, like I told y'all, I am doing locks full time. I wanna, 
I'm thinking about getting into braiding. Like, I've always been a braider, y'all. As much as I've done, like, well, not as... I was doing braids before I was actually doing locks. So, like, I like braiding hair sometimes. And the newer braids are, like, so creative. I wouldn't mind trying to see if I could do them. Just the challenge of seeing if I could do them seems very fun. But, um... Yeah... So, I definitely think I want to get into braiding. And, like, with me going to cosmetology school, that's going to open up the avenue for so many things, y'all. Because you learn how to do nails in cosmetology school. I'm not much of an artist. I'm not even going to lie. See, I'm not much of an artist. I probably do a lot of screen print nails. But just the idea of knowing that I can learn how to do my own nails if I need to, that's going to be what's up. Um, I, just, I do sew ins all the time. So, that'll be nice to know that I'll be able to do sew ins I think they said that you do lashes now, too. I'm going to ask. That's a few questions. I'm a, I got a couple questions I'm going to ask why I'm here. And that's definitely one of them. Like, is lashing, did you all teach you how to do lashes now? Because I heard that was a part of the new cosmetology curriculum, is lashes. That would be a plus, too, because then look, locks of lashes, I could do whatever. You know what I'm saying? Yo, this gas station always fucking pet, yo. Like, God damn. I just want me a Red Bull, Mr. Mister. That's all I want me is a Red Bull. Okay. Go inside of here. Give me a Red Bull. So I can get on the road and head to this school. Y'all like my little necklace I got from Shein? Too cute. Too, too cute and my nails don't pay attention it's time for a filling i didn't have these since the cruise and that was last month and i got content from that y'all remind me to post that content <laughs> i got so much content though y'all like so much content so so much content as i expected they didn't have any sugar free so i just bought this dragon fruit one but y'all, I'm about to hit this street. Like I said, it's not that far. We're not going too far from my house. So I'm about to go ahead and hit the road to go there. Um, I'm about to listen to this little baby album, y'all. If y'all are not on it, get on it, y'all. Like, with me living in Atlanta, y'all, that's all I've been hearing. Literally, even when I'm just in my apartment, that's all I've been hearing people pulling up listening to is that little baby. So if you ain't on it, then I don't know what you got going on. I mean, the whole album riding, 1 through 23, it's at least three or four songs that you got to like on there. I mean, I like every song, no lie. A couple of them are my favorites so far because I listened to them quite a few times. But, yeah. Get on that album, y'all. And I'll talk to y'all later. I'll give y'all an update about the school and all that good stuff um, later. So, yeah.